So I'm here at gorgeous Catechias Mykonos with the general manager, Aguilos. Hello. Calimera, Aguilos. Calimera, Calimera. How are you this morning? Welcome. I'm doing great. Great, thank uh, you. I just want to welcome you to Catechias Mykonos Hotel, and I would be more than happy to show you around. Great. Can you tell me a little bit about the hotel here? How, how old is it? How, uh, tell me a little bit about the design and, and what people can expect here. The hotel is relatively new. Actually, uh, there was an existing hotel over here, but four years ago, approximately, it got fully renovated uh, by the owner and um, it has created a brand new property, uh, new rooms, new facilities, and well, you're about to see that. Great, can you tell me a little bit about the size uh, and some of the amenities and then we'll take a tour? Certainly, uh, what you will find in the Catechias Mykonos property is um, uh, there are two pools, one which is at the level which is right above us, one at the highest uh, level of the hotel, and then you also got two restaurants, uh, the Celts uh, restaurant where you will find creative Mediterranean cuisine and some sushi as well. Uh, you'll also find uh, Mikrasia restaurant, which is a fine dining uh, restaurant with Greek Anatolian cuisine, a mixture of uh, well, old traditional, let's say, Greek cuisine, and put in a more fine dining, uh, contemporary way and presentation. And of course, you will find our A Spa, which is using exclusively Linz and Barth products in order to make it even more uh, premium as an experience. Great. Let's take a look around. Okay, follow me. And of course, this is where the check-in experience and the experience with the Catechia Mykonos begins. Right now, our lobby and our concert desk, but all of our guests can enjoy uh, services such as making all of the bookings, all the arrangements which are necessary, a boat trip, um, an excursion, um, whatever it might be needing. Here's where we assist them. So here we're located at Celt. Uh, this is our all-day restaurant, and this is where someone can start uh, their day with a beautiful breakfast. Currently, they can choose either from a la carte or buffet breakfast. And this is where everything starts, at the Catechias Mykonos. You can continue, of course, with a nice Mediterranean lunch with uh, contemporary cuisine and also some uh, very exquisite sushi options as well. Or, of course, just enjoy a glass of champagne or aperitivo in the afternoon hours, right before dinner, either at Celts or Mikrasia restaurant or by having a beautiful stroll and walk into town. So here we are at our uh, main pool, uh, which is located right below the Celts restaurant, uh, offering very beautiful views towards Dilos, uh, the background. And of course, this is where can, someone can have snacks by the pool, or even a light lunch, or drinks, of course, and enjoy relaxing music, and of course, the, the comfort of our pool. So we're here at the A Spa by Linz and Barth, the Catechias Mykonos Hotel. Overall, we have four A Spas within the group, and one of them is located here at uh, Mykonos Island. And what's special about our spa is the fact that we're using exclusively a, um, the products of Linz and Barth, either for the uh, massages that we have um, a wide selection of either 60 or 90 minutes uh, massages. We have also one uh, really, well, um, interesting treatment, the, the warm shells treatment, which is one of our signature treatments. Uh, we have a wide selection also of facial treatments, exclusively, again, using Saint Barth products in order to increase the uh, moisturization of the skin, the elasticity of uh, the skin, and our spa is available throughout the day for a guest, either from uh, 10 o'clock in the morning to 8 o'clock in the evening. So after well, a day by the beach, I think it, what's perfect is to have a treatment on our spa in order to soothe a little bit the skin from uh, the sun and the sea. So right now we're uh, at Mikrasia restaurant. This is where a second pool is located. We have a very beautiful infinity pool with a beautiful view towards Dilos Island. Excuse me for frowning, but as you may know, Dilos is one of the brightest spots on Greece. So we get to have lots of sun and lots of brightness over here, uh, which is by the way, considered to be the birthplace of Apollo, the light of God, according to ancient Greeks. So from this location, you have beautiful views either towards the, the south and to Agios Ioannis Beach, where we are located or uh, towards Dilos Island and of course what you see over here that will be set up as um, our second pool in the evening you will see it transformed into our fine dining restaurant Mikrasia this mixture of Greek and Anatolian cuisine now tell me about this pool this is very different it's sort of uh, it's special and unique can you tell me about it it is indeed because I mean as you uh, well as you might be feeling Mykonos is um, an island which is very windy especially during the summer months so since Agios Ioannis the area that we are located is a little bit more protected from the wind but still you get a very nice and strong breeze uh, especially during July and August what we have tried to do over here is to bring the beach uh, to our guests right over here from the comfort of the hotel. So this explains the, the setup with the sand on the floor and also this is what we have done at this infinity pool. It has the, the feeling that you are walking into the sand and you're walking into the actual 
uh, beach and seawater. So that's the concept, having the views, having the sands, but not compromising either on the comfort of a beautiful five-star property. That's the concept of it. Great, and then you've got the patio up here for the dining room at night as well. Of course, this is where we're setting up for dinner. Uh, I, as mentioned, it's a fine dining restaurant. Uh, you will see a very beautiful setup with uh, uh, tablecloths and beautiful candles and uh, fine dining, either um, the degustation menus that we have available, either uh, the a la carte menus that we have available. Still, the service, the feeling, the comfort, and um, well, the elegance is there. However, uh, we feel that being in a fine dining restaurant in such a destination could make feel people a little bit too, uh, how should I put it? Uh, a little bit too um, tight, uh, but still, uh, by having the sand, as I explained here before, it makes it a little bit more comfortable. It makes a little bit, uh, you feel a little bit more grounded in the energy of the island. So what we want end of the day is to make feel, uh, people like home, make the film comfortable, uh, but still offer fine dining cuisine. Great, it's a gorgeous spot and so perfect for a romantic night after the sunset. Which is true, we also had some uh, wedding proposals uh, over here or the birthday celebration, but it was just a romantic dinner over the beautiful lights uh, of IUC and Serbia. Right, and there's also just a cocktail space if people want to enjoy a drink before going out for dinner elsewhere. Of course, and not just drinks, but special uh, about this um, um, restaurant of the hotel is that at the lounge area that you have mentioned, we can also offer shisha, or shisha can be offered also after dinner. Sisha uh, sounds a little bit Arabic, but uh, for the Micrasian, the minor Asia culture, it was um, kind of a, a ritual, either before or after lunch or dinner. So um, as part of the concept of the restaurant, we also have Sisha available in um, different flavors that we create over here at the restaurant. So uh, over here at the Karikis Mykonos, we also grow our, our own herbs. Uh, one of the I'd say the, the strong aspects of uh, our property is sustainability. So among other activities that we're taking, we also grow our own herbs, which our chefs at the cuisine and our bartenders are using for their cocktails and well, the recipes in general. So some of them you can see them grown over here. You can see our lavender, you can see some thyme or rosemary, uh, but we also have the sweet scented geranium, which is one of my favorites. And of course we have lots of mints and peppermints as well, which are perfect for our cocktails and recipes. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe to see more super useful travel videos about Greece and beyond from SantoriniDave.com.